Earlier this week, the Bureau of Land Management began the largest operation in Colorado history to gather wild horses in northwestern Colorado. The BLM blames the drought for leaving the animals without enough resources to survive. The roundup process uses a helicopter to drive horses into traps, but horse enthusiasts want it all to stop. Here's reporter Nelson Garcia from our news partners in Denver. Oh. Hold on. Hold on, let me get in here. Before these horses live near Longmont. And I got him when he was just nine months old. And he's now 11. They lived in the wild of Wyoming. I know. Now they live with Carol Walker, who adopted them after what she calls brutal roundups by the Bureau of Land Management. I was at the last helicopter roundup in 2008 that they did there, and 11 horses died. The horses are important. The sage grouse is important. The antelope are important. We need to make sure there's plenty of food in the kitchen for all of them. Bruce Silito manages the BLM office, which oversees horses in the San Wash Basin, west of Craig, Colorado. We follow very stringent safety requirements. We take very good care of those horses. We make sure the foals are separated so they don't get trampled. He says drought conditions require the removal of about 730 wild horses, which will be adopted out to the public, about 82% of the herd. And so it's very important to not only have healthy horses, but it's a very important to have healthy rangeland. These horses are not dying. I was there three weeks ago. There, things had gotten pretty sparse during the summer, but then the rains came. Walker says she took these pictures three weeks ago of healthy horses drinking at watering holes. She believes the real reason the BLM wants to remove the wild horses is to allow ranchers to let their sheep graze and drink on the same land. And to put livestock out when there's supposedly a drought emergency is crazy. Silito says the livestock only uses about 4% of the water and vegetation in the San Wash Basin. The other 95% of the resources are used by horses. We have data on that. It shows clearly that the horses are using the abundance of the resources. And he's 13 and I've had him for 11 years. Walker doesn't believe it. And while she loves her horses. But you know what? I would rather he had grown up in the wild where he belonged. Just like the wild horses in the San Wash Basin.